What's up YouTube? It's Thursday and I don't I don't know what the date is. A few day, couple days after Christmas. Well anyway, we had a little dusting last night. You can see that pathway is about 10, 12 inches somewhere around there. More coming. They say, I don't know. Maybe into next week I see another storm coming up this way, so we're back to normal. Last year was like summertime. I hear sirens going off. You guys hear that? Either it's 12 o'clock or we're getting invaded or something. Well, anyway, let's go take a look at the chicken coop. I finished it up finally. I got in behind the house because the snow was coming. Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to move it with the trailer. So let's go take a peek. I got a couple other little things I got to do on it. I got to do the roosting, uh, some roosting porches uh, for them. And... Uh, I think that's about it, the water and the feeder and everything. I was just out here making some pathways to the to get to some of these things, feed the rabbits and the chickens and stuff. Well anyway, here it is. I put a red tin roof on it. And I would say it's probably 60% made out of pallets. The rafters I made out of the pallets and all the siding and some of the inside is made from pallets. The only thing that I bought was a tin roof, um, the floor, a couple sheets of plywood and some 2x4. So I'd say I probably got about 200, 250 into it. So let's take a little peek. I'll show you some of the little features I put on it. This is the, the nesting boxes on the side here. Put a little door with a little gate latch on it. You can get in here and you can get the eggs. You don't have to go inside. And on the back, I made this so I can get in here and clean it. So I've had the whole back come out. The only thing I got to do is I got to put two handles on here and get to that yet. And here's the back. Show you a little peek inside. Alright, here's inside. Let's see if you can see in here. That's the nest boxes that you can get from the outside. I gotta do the little nesting porches for them. Put a little window in and come on this side. Let me just set this thing down here. This tripod for a second. Yeah, that's an old window I had in the garage. Let me set this down. Bear with me one second. There's a little ramp I made on one side so they can get up and get in there, and then I could close it up at night. Keep the predators away. Uh, you know, you never know. They can still get them during the day. Maybe you, a hawk or a coyote or fox come flying out of the woods and grab one. But I try my best because I lost my whole flock that I had in that coop from I don't even know what it was. I'm thinking it might have been a weasel. So next year that coop is going to be a goat little goat barn I'm gonna get a couple goats so anyway here is the free-range chicken coop well, next time you see it you're gonna see some chickens in it Robin's gotta look at some chickens that she wants to get so she'll be ordering those probably in a month month and a half or so I'll keep them in the house a little bit before the spring and we can get them outside all right, YouTube, take care.